This is another Hesperosaurus, and this one's less complete, as you can see. It's got an original spike there, a plate. It's got the cute little tiny humerus, radius and ulna, versus a much longer, gracile, almost diplodocid style femur. It's got a big, wide plate here. See, it's fairly horizontal. And uh, it's got some tail bones. Generic, very thin. You can see how I call it pancakes. They're just narrow, anterior, posterior. They've got very simple spines laid back. Often they're bifurcated and swollen on top because whatever musculature was controlling this tail uh, was powerful. And you see the chevrons, they go all the way back, even though these are cast on apex, they're all the way to the end, they're chevron facets. So whatever was, they, have, they had fine, fine control of their tail, I would argue. And I guess if your weaponry has four giant spikes, you really do need some ability to place it. But stegosaurs are seemingly far more common than I ever realized. I think it's cool. <laughs>